Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel and to another plan with me. Plan with me's are back to Wednesdays now because I'm like mostly caught up. So now instead of doing like two a week, I'm gonna just do one a week. Um, but I'm using the Lakeside Standard Vertical Kit from my shop and I have the glitter add-on. Normally I would use the box add-on, but I think it was an oops kit I've got or like some of the add-ons were oops and I ended up just having the glitter. So box is my preference, but I've got the glitter one. Um, and it is for the week of the 12th to the 18th of September. I've also pulled out some foil from Tilly Journals. This is the soft rose gold. I think it's the only rose gold she does now. Um, so I've got the 15 millimeter um, overlay and I'm just putting it on my thick washi because too lazy to cut it and I don't have the 15 millimeter add-on <laughs> pulled out from the shop. So I'm just gonna use it like normal, but I really like how it looks anyway. Um, the bottom washi is so pretty, like this like tree pattern is just really nice. Um, so yeah, this was the week before my birthday. Um, <laughs> I wanted to cover up the 2022, but I didn't have my Tombow um, whiteout pen. So I just used a bit of sticker paper, which works and you can kind of see it, but it's not too bad. Um, and those are just the big um, month stickers that I made myself. Um, I might release them, but no one's asked for them, so <laughs> I probably won't unless I get asked. Um, but yes, this is my sidebar and I've got a little paper shire, like, decorative window because, I don't know, just didn't really know what to put there, so I thought I would try and use up some of the, like, bigger flat lay, flat lay type stickers that I've got in my album. We've got the glitter headers along the top as usual and... This spread is just really cute. I'm trying to remember what happened this week. Um, oh, I had the, had the MOT for the car. So like the annual test that your car has to have. That was on Thursday. Um, we played a lot of Immortality, which is a game, but it's a bit like a movie. I don't think I've explained this on a plan with me before, but basically you have to like watch um, clips from three different movies to piece together a story and it, I think it's a horror game it's interesting anyway now now I'm talking about it I feel like I've maybe told you about it before I think I definitely have anyway um still recommend <laughs> from the last time that I told you so now I'm just putting on my foil I've got like um these I don't remember what Tilly calls them but they're like circular like circles made together into like a line and it's, it's really pretty so I thought I would use those on some of the full boxes and conserve my overlays but yeah um moving on to the plans on Monday the first thing I did was I pulled stickers and I've marked that with a doodle from the kit and an appointment label then I marked that I filmed some plan with me's with a paper shire like it's a voiceover sticker but it's suitable for plan with me's and it's got like a little yellow bit inside which matches the kit really well and a script from ice cream joe i then had to contact my cello bag company because my cellos are all custom made so the size of like sheet i have for the silhouettes it doesn't fit standard cellos and i wanted it to be like a really like not a tight fit but like a perfect fit so i have to get them custom made maybe like every two years because I have to order 10,000 of them. <laughs> so I think it was like every year. I don't know. But basically I had to get a new quote and order those. And they actually haven't come yet. And it's been, interestingly, it's now been like three weeks. So I should probably chase that up. Um, we then had to feed uh, Tom's brother's fish because he went away. So we did that all this week. But I only marked it on the Monday because one, I don't have any fish stickers and two, it didn't really like take that long so it didn't really seem like it needed to be put on every day but I marked it with dog food so that was that I then marked that I washed my hair in the evening with a wash hair script from my shop which I cut up because I always use the stacked ones and I have loads of the long ones left and I marked that with a stick with the Planco showering squidge and then I marked that we played some games and that was Immortality. So I used my custom couple from Fox and Cactus, which is so old. Like I literally have had that stick of like six years, <laughs> but they're super cute. And the only difference is that I'm blonder now, um, but I'm actually thinking about going back to brown. So they would probably become relevant again. <laughs> 
Anyway, on to Tuesday. I marked that it was Sophie's birthday, rhyme of plans. Um, we actually went for a meal to like, I said that really weird, we went for a meal. But that was like three weeks on from this actual date. Um, but it was nice to get together with some planner friends. Um, and then the gardener came. We have to get someone to trim the hedge at the front of our garden probably like twice a year um, because we can't do it ourselves. So that was that, which I marked with a leaf from the kit. And then I had a nail appointment. Um, yes, <laughs> which I marked with a piece of deco that's from my shop on a multicolor sheet and a script from Ice Cream Joe. And on the way back from my nail appointment, I often get Costa because it's on the way. So I marked a Costa run, which is a custom script from Ice Cream Joe with an icon from the kit. And then I, I'm trying to remember, this was the day I was really brave and I was like, well, brave. <laughs> I, I don't like going to the tip on my own. In fact, I've never been. And I've been decluttering. I had loads of stuff and I was like, I'm going to take it to the tip because it's on my way. After I go to Costa, I can go to the tip or like the other way around because it's en route. It saves us a journey. So that's what I went to do. I got to the tip and it was closed. <laughs> they close on like Tuesdays and Wednesdays or something like really, really random. So we ended up like, well, I came home and I explained to Tom and he was like, should we go to the other tip? So he ended up going with me in the end. So I didn't really conquer my fear, but at least we the stuff was taken which is the main thing so I marked up with a Coffee Monsters Co bin sticker I then filmed more plan with me's so I marked that with a paper shire camera and I did some printing and cutting I think this was the premium map mystery um this day because that would have been September mystery and then we played as dusk falls in the evening which is really fun it's like um kind of like a choose your own adventure game but not like a book, it's a game instead. <laughs> um, on to Wednesday, I had my singing lesson in the morning, which I marked with a once more with love um, munchkin <laughs> and a script from Ice Cream Joe. And then I've marked a coffee and sausage roll. <laughs> we were like, or just like weirdly hungry. I don't know what the pause is here, by the way. I'll edit this out in a bit. Um, we were really hungry and I was like, I always see it advertised on Facebook. There's a little like coffee van that has like pastries and stuff as well. Um, so we were like, okay, well let's go and find it because it's parked at a nearby village hall. I think it's a village hall. So I made Tom go to this little van in the next village. Um, and <laughs> I thought they were going to have breakfast sandwiches. So I was like, you can have a breakfast sandwich. It'll be worth it. And we got there and they didn't have any. <laughs> and they didn't actually have like any food that he would like. I got a sausage roll and he did get one but it, it had like onion chutney or something in it and he doesn't like that so it was a bit of a fail and I got a coffee and it was okay but it wasn't the greatest <laughs> so yeah I marked it anyway um at least we tried we tried it we got the experience anyway the next thing I did was I designed which I marked with a doodle from the kit and a script from my shop um I had to do a voiceover for my plan with me so I've just marked edit plan with me with the voiceover sticker and then I packaged some orders in the afternoon which again I marked with a doodle from my shop then I had to figure out <laughs> I want some new curtains for the living room so I was trying to like calculate the drop and the size and also just like why my curtains don't hang very well turns out I've been hanging them wrong the past like four years but you live and you learn so now I know why they look bad so <laughs> at least I can fix it but yeah, I've asked my mum for the curtains for Christmas, so that's fun. Then we got pizza, or we, I don't know if we just cooked pizza. It's unclear in my notes, but who knows. Marked that with a Coffee Monsters Go pizza sticker. These are new. And then we, well, new to me. They may not be new. <laughs> and then we played some more Immortality. And we actually finished it this day. It's one of those games where we were finding stuff out and then we were like, have we finished the game because we kept going in circles for a bit and kind of googled like does it have an ending do, do we know when we finished it and there was an ending so we were kind of playing it aimlessly for a bit but yeah we did actually finish it that day then on thursday the car had its mot so i took it to the um, mot center at 9 45 they always say like do you need it back for a specific time and I always say no because I'm going to go across the road and sit in like Costa or a cafe somewhere 
but I was like, I'm going to say that, like, earlier the better, because I think they always, like, deprioritize me when I say no. So that was my theory, and I actually got it back earlier this time, so I think I'm correct in that theory. <laughs> but I spent some time designing that day. I did a bit of advent, some notepads, just doing, like, design. Because last year, when I had the MOT, is when I designed the 2021 advent. So it's kind of like a, sig a signal to me in the year that that's when I need to be doing advent. And advent is what I'm doing this week and next week, so kind of nice that it's like structured that way. Um, what else did I mark? Yeah, I've got advent as a deadline. Um, the car passed the MOT, which was really good, so I marked that with a happy emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. And I also prepped the mystery this day, which I marked with a script from my shop, um, which is custom by. I could potentially release like actual mystery scripts because I've been asked for them before and <laughs> I haven't done them because I'm awful at remembering what to do. That's why we have the request thread and then I check that when I go and do new releases each week. Um, and then I also marked that we played Fall Guys in the evening. I think we played this with Becca and Josh, I think. Yeah. And I marked that with a doodle controller from my shop. Then on to Friday, I did some more orders in the morning, finished packaging those because I needed to do the post run, and then I did the listings for new releases. I think we skipped new releases the week before, so that was why I marked new releases this week, because we didn't have them before. Um, both of those are the Coffee Monsters Co. stickers. I then marked doing the post run, and I also had to post an eBay parcel. So I used this Chocho and Mimi post mail script. Then I painted my nails, my toenails. Um, I didn't like have two nail appointments in one week, um, which I marked with a munchkin and a nail script. And I did this while we were playing Fall Guys because like when you die, you're, you get to watch the rest of your team play. So I like, every time I died, I was like, right, time to do another coat, <laughs> which was quite efficient. Um, I then marked Remember Planner Sale because there was a few things I had to submit for the Ultimate Planner Sale this day. So I had to make sure that I didn't forget to do that by the deadline. Um, and yeah, this was just marking playing Fall Guys with another controller. Moving on to Saturday, the first thing I marked was a hair wash day again. The same way as before with a wash hair script and a stick with the Planko squidge. They're so cute. <laughs> Um, I then marked that I had to return a shredder that I bought from Amazon. Um, I ordered it, started to use it, and then realised that in the, like, bucket, I guess, like, where it catches the shredded paper, had a huge hole in it, <laughs> and, like, for some reason I just didn't notice, I had already started to use it, so I complained and sent it back, and they, they gave me, like, credit towards a new one, and when I reordered my new one, it had actually gone down in price, <laughs> so I made, like, a pound back. So that was good. Um, I then marked that I tidied the office a little bit. Oh my god. I just looked down. I've completely spilt like coffee all over my top. <laughs> Great. Um, <laughs> another plan with me. Another spilt coffee. Um, yes, yeah, so I marked tidy office with a vacuum cleaner. And I organised some stickers. I think this is when I moved my calax around. Yeah, so I rotated it and moved my filming desk slightly. Um, and it's much better now. I then marked that I just did some, I've remarked work, but it's oops bags, because I'm trying to do them more regularly so that they're, the words, so that I don't get behind on them, and it's actually working, like I think I mentioned this before and said I would update you, and lo and behold, it's better than leaving it till the last minute, who knew, who would have known, but yeah, <laughs> uh, so that was that. I then marked that we had Stardew Saturday with Julia and Sean with a fishing Coffee Monsters Co. sticker and then we played some Mad Libs, um, which I used to play loads, um, I guess not as a child but like as a teen and I don't know if they'd played it before or like they didn't remember, they couldn't remember playing it before or something, I don't know but it was so funny, <laughs> it's literally the best thing. Um, so yeah, I, I will put a link to the Mad Libs generator that we used because I think it was quite a good one. Then on to Sunday, I marked that we went to Starbucks and I got an iced coffee. I don't really know if I actually got an iced coffee or if I've just put that because 
I don't know, like, it's September, I'll be getting warm drinks, <laughs> but that coffee, that, um, paper shy cat is so cute, and I've had it for so long, so I'm glad I finally used it. I then edited the vlog, which I marked with a movie sticker from the kit, and did some loads of laundry, because laundry just piles up. I'll do, like, I'll be really good for, like, three days, and then do no laundry for a week, and then be like, oh, where have my clothes gone? <laughs> so, yeah, <laughs> that was that. I went for a roast with my dad, we went to this pub, um, we've been there a few times before but that was really nice, we got the carvery and then I went for a walk with Tom, we went to Bradgate Park and I had a bit of a tummy ache and I don't know why I thought a walk would help but it didn't and then we were like walking up this hill and I was like we need to stop, I need to sit down, <laughs> it was so bad um, and then we started watching Four in a Bed, just on a whim, and then we had like two weeks of binging Four in a Bed, so I highly recommend. <laughs> um, these are the stickers that I've got left. Sheets are in a random order, sorry about that. Um, check boxes, loads of glitter stickers, most of my half boxes, and my deco. And yeah, this is the completed spread. I really hope you like how it turned out. I think it looks so pretty with the rose gold foil. And thanks for watching, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.